VIP. I always deliver. Time to twirl! Time for a lesson. This big diamond! It's all yours! Time to twirl! Bending the rules. You won't get away. Your life it's okay, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. There's no backing out now. For me or you. Self-inflicted misery. Time to twirl! Who's the little backstabber? This big diamond! It's all yours! <laughs> Doors echo! Time for a lesson. Time to twirl! This big diamond! It's all yours! Bending the rules. Time for a lesson. Time to twirl! You won't get away. Time to twirl! There's no backing out now, for me or you. Time to twirl! Self-inflicted misery! Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Time to twirl! This big diamond! It's all yours!
<laughs> Go Nappy! Stand to Earth! Here stands the Silvermane Guard! <laughs> Not a step back! Right on time! Just uh, give it up! Yes, you! <laughs> Right on time! Here stands the Silvermane Guard! Leave through clouds! Just give it up! Yes, you! Not a step back! Descend to Earth! Right on time! Here stands the Silvermane Guard! Strike! Just give it up! Yes, you! Eliminating threat! Covering oh. mountains! <laughs> right on time! Not a step back! Huh. Here stands the Silvermane Guard! <laughs> the big fight is won! Help me, Mr. Storm! Not a step back! Huh. Oh. Oh. Just give it up! Stay back, Clara. Here stands the Silvermane Guard! Yes, you! Right on time! Just give it up! Yes, you! Not a step back! After fighting in so many knockout stages, I think our points should be enough. Time to head to the Sky Splitter's leaderboard to confirm our ranking. Ready to challenge some powerful opponents! Okay! Time to get fired up! Let's head back to the lounge! Already a few matches have gone by in the blink of an eye! Have you gotten used to the situation, Luca? <laughs> yes! Uh, yes, uh, I have. But the hallucinations are getting stronger. Could there actually be something wrong with me? Can culture shock really cause such strong hallucinations? It's possible. There was a scholar from the Intelligentsia Guild who wished for an audience with the erudition, no matter the cost. But he went mad the instant he laid eyes on Noose. Ooh, the minds of organic life forms are very fragile. Uh, you're starting to scare me now. <sighs> Good thing I've got plenty of youth left to burn. I can't falter now. The next match is going to be crucial. And my opponent is... Uh, I guess you can call her an 
old acquaintance. Never met her in the flesh, but when Bellabug wouldn't know of her. Oh, Miss Topaz is the cutest among the ten stone hearts. Oh, I like her. No offense, Miss Carmella, but I'm not keen on the IPC. They nearly turned my home into an asset that could be bundled and sold. Mr. Luca, the IPC is a megacorp. It's easy to pin labels on people, but at the end of it, everyone we meet is living flesh and bones with feelings. I I'm also an IPC staff member. Do you hate me too? I spoke out of turn. Please forgive my rudeness, Miss Carmella. You're right. You're right. I should find out what kind of person Topaz is for myself. Mr. Luca, the IPC is a mega cool. You're right. IPC's participating representative. Honestly, I don't really hate her. I heard she was the one who granted the time extension. Maybe she's not so bad after all, but I have a certain instinctive wariness of those bigwigs from the IPC. No, I can't let that fear control me. If she's my opponent, I will let her witness our strength. I can't lose to her. Luca, are you ready to fight? I'm ready. <laughs> I'm also ready to record some footage. in the ring. Two competitors with a deep-seated rivalry. The atmosphere is already charged with tension before the first punch has even been thrown. You can feel the fireworks are about to explode in the blue corner. Representing Team Bellabog, Luca Stronger in the red corner. It's the liquidation specialist of the Inter Astral Peace Corporation, Topaz the Debt Retriever. Who would have thought the people of Urillo 6 would start making waves in the cosmos? It's a pleasure to see you here at the war dance. I'm really looking forward to this match too, Miss Topaz. This is a great opportunity for us to showcase our Bellabogian pride to you. Long time no see. I wasn't expecting to see you here. I hear you're Team Bellabog's coach, which really surprised me. The Astral Express helped mediate Bellabog's debt previously, and now you're assisting them in the war dance. <laughs> when a child is growing up, they need to learn to find their own footing in the world. The Bellabogians have always lived under difficult conditions. We children already knew our path forward long ago. <laughs> A lofty proclamation. I harbor no ill will towards Bellabog. I merely wish to see if, uh, after evading that debt crisis, the people of Bellabog can truly stand on their own. If we rely too much on the charity of major influences to help us overcome hardships, they will never truly become free, but rather remain a servant under the illusion of freedom. The people of Bellabog have never been servants! 
I apologize. <laughs> Just speaking my mind. It uh, appears I've ruffled some feathers. Time to get on the stage, Luke of Bellaba. You said it! Let's go! We may not call upon the Amber Lord's might, but that doesn't mean we'll go easy on you. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? Time for a buzz. <laughs> Those who can knock down Luca, I'll be sure to give you an excellent score in your performance evaluation. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Let's roll, people, for our performance evaluation! Double speed? Human creations! I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Destined for oblivion. for the departed. It too shall fall. Your subordinate forces have almost been little down. Looks like Topaz is prepared to take to the field herself. Not like I have a choice. If you want something done properly, do it yourself. <gasps> Madam Kukolia? Huh? What did you just call me? Uh it appears Luca is dazed all of a sudden. No, it's nothing. Come at me, Miss Topet. No, my hallucinations are getting worse. <laughs> Looks like it's time to get serious. You are doomed to fail. What a motion. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Tremble before my power. Again, destined for oblivion. Time for a buzz. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You are doomed to fail. Again. Yin and Yang. On the still waters of oblivion. New. Destined for oblivion. The eternal breeze will bury you. Coming in hot. Get in there, Luca. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? This is double speed. I weep for the departed. Everyone is screaming for Luke. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? This is double speed. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. <laughs> you fight well, Mr. Luca. But it's time to end this game of playing house. Human creations! The opponent has stepped up their offense. 
They are probably trying to end it quickly so they can get off worker. Still waters of oblivion. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Destined for oblivion. Time for a buzz. Gather as one. Apologies, but it looks like this match that should have been yours will end here. Witness the avalanche! I weep for the departed. <laughs> it too shall fall. Judgment of eternal winter! <clears throat> like this. Strong. She wasn't even using her power just now. She has been completely courted by Topaz. Able to turn the tide on his precarious predicament. Luca, get it together. Throw a punch. Keep moving, Luca. The boxing champ of Boulder Town can't fall here. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? This is double speed. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Human creations. Destiny for oblivion. I weep for the departed. Since you're already here, why not have a meal before you leave? This is double speed. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Bellabog has proven its superiority and defended its honor. What a roller coaster of emotions. <sighs> Unbelievable. Isn't that Snowy Owl an IPC employee? Why is he getting so sentimental? <sighs> Luca, you fought well. Victory is yours. <sighs> you pulled your punches, Miss Topaz. Um, you're mistaken. For the Ten Stone Hearts, going all out is something we only do in life and death situations. This is nothing but a casual spar. Best that everyone emerges unscathed without a scratch. We don't want the IPC's protective gear sales to take a hit now, do we? You took the win. Have more faith in yourself. This was a hard-earned victory. And with all due respect, it was you who underestimated me, right? Of course not. I wouldn't dare look down on one of the IPC's legendary employees. You peg everyone with an IPC job title as one of their lapdogs. You think we've sold our souls and become servants for profit. Don't deny that. I know that look all too well. The IPC doesn't need bleeding, intangible goods like souls. They only want profit. My home and Bellabog aren't so different. We are all struggling to eke out an existence in this merciless universe, hell-bent on living long enough to touch happiness. And the messengers of the Amber Lord gave me that chance. Just as I, on behalf of the IPC, am giving you that exact same chance. So, you understand now? We have much, much more in common than you think, Luca. I hope that Bella Bug can find the strength within to lift itself up. Now, you've left your city in hopes of getting the cosmos to notice you, and that's certainly admirable. But in this cosmos full of selfishness and malice, are you truly prepared to face even greater crises? Whether you are or not, 
I wish you the best of luck. <sighs> keep it up, and keep winning matches. I've had my fill, so I should be leaving. I have a lot of negotiations to attend to back on the Lofu. This topaz, wait. Hmm? <sighs> it wasn't my intent to look down on you. I believe anyone striving to survive is... <laughs> Don't take it to heart. Isn't it a tradition to trash talk each other before a match starts? Hallucinations are getting worse. When I was fighting Topaz, do you know who I saw? I saw Madame Kokolia standing at the other end of the ring, summoning blades of ice aimed at... <sighs> I guess so. I don't think this is just some simple culture shock issue. Oh, I know! It's gotta be some IPC baddie dressed up as the Supreme Guardian, so you would hesitate to attack there's a break coming up, so there won't be any fights. Luca, you can use this chance to rest and recuperate. Uh, I do need a break. I'm not actually an Iron Man or anything. Speaking of which, Pitch Dark Cook the Great, what are you doing here on your own? 
Where'd Svalrog go? Svalrog said he needed to do some data sampling. He asked Hook to wait for him here and not disturb Luca. Hook has been a goodie and waiting here alone. Data sampling? <sighs> Forget it. It's not something I should be worrying about. Coach, I think I need to get my symptoms looked at. But where can I see a doctor on the Xianzhou? Please, if you don't mind. <sighs> I hope they're as good as Natasha. Divination Commission do again? A simple explanation would be that they are the information technology department on the Sienjo. They are mainly responsible for predicting the future. Predicting the future? I guess they're kind of a big deal. At first I thought she was a little awkward, but I guess she just uh, doesn't like socializing. What should we do first? See a doctor or go to the Divination Commission? I agree. If the hallucinations are getting bad, we should see a doctor sooner rather than later. I wanna go too! I wanna go- What did Sparog say? Pitch Dark Hook the Great isn't allowed to disturb Luca. But this lounge is so small and boring. I can't show off my moves in a tiny place like this. Then, Pitch Dark Hook the Great, shall I take you to our room alley to eat yummy food? Have you ever eaten a song lotus cake that chirps? I've never eaten it before. What's that? If I can taste this sun blotter's cake, I'll... Uh, I'll make you the mole's grand captain of gourmet discovery! Thank you, Pitch Dark Hook the Great! Let's set off right now. Huh, Miss Carmella is such a kind person. She could get along with Hook so quickly. Okay, coach. We should get going, too. This is the Alchemy Commission? This whole place is a hospital? Can it get any bigger than this? Wow, cutting edge medicine. You must really be something to bring me straight here to get treated. 